So guys, today is our last day, last morning here in Barakay and our last breakfast. So a lot of people. I'm the first one because our flight is early so we have to have breakfast early as well. So it's, yeah. That's the end of my travels. Hello guys, it's our last day in Abaracay, so we just paid the terminal fee, the ticket, it cost us 100 pesos and also we rode a trike from our hotel, 150 for two people, okay, and we are now in a boat here. Check now, it's 22 minutes past their flight. Thank you for your patience and understanding. Hello, good day. So I finally, I will finally finish this travel vlog, my day five in Boracay, with some uh, 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 discussion on that that the budget, the financial aspect of the travel. Let me show you my budget for this trip. Okay, so ito yon. So as you can see here, uh, Boracay trip in, in April 2022, two week, I think two weeks ago. So transpo 8,000 and so on. So these are actual, actually. So these are actual expenses. And uh, as you can see, I spent, yeah. For, for this trip, you will have to spend the uh, Mag isa lang, no? 32,000 pesos. But let's study now my Boracay trip last May to 2019, three years ago. And uh, including everything, similar to this, no? But uh, these are the, the daily expenses that I did. So you can see, yeah, so the hotel accommodation is 12,000. This is for three days. At uh, two, uh, two nights, three days. Airfare is about 7,000. And the uh, specifics, the daily expenses. So yeah, every day I, I have a massage. That's my relaxation on the beach. That time it was still allowed, but now hindi na. So bawal na magpa-massage on the, along the beach. So bawal na. And then, yeah, massage every day is a really relaxing day. And uh, this time I, I did some parasailing, helmet diving, basically water sports. Okay. So so for the total transport here, I, I spent 7000 this includes the, 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 the tricycle, the, the taxis, lodging accommodation hotel is about uh, 12,000 for the two nights, three days. Uh, food and drinks, uh, mostly food, <laughs> 6,000. Entertainment uh, and relaxation, massage. So this time, hindi ako nagka-karaoke, but just the, the massage every day. Uh, activities and water sports, I did some parasailing, helmet diving, and... Uh, Island hopping. So, nagawa ko yun again during this trip. 3,500. Other expenses, souvenirs. Uh, so, the total is uh, 31,471. So, this was uh, accounted for on my daily uh, expenses. Okay. Now, let's try to, to plan for a family of uh, four. So, kunyari, inanay, tatay, at dalawang anak. So sa transpo, siguro you have to consider, you have to book early as, 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 as early as you can para hindi mahal yung charges ng, ng, ng airplane. So let's say 3,000 per person times 4, that's uh, 12 plus yung taxi, considering uh, other transportation, no? taxi, um, the boat, the tricycle so perhaps 500 per person so 500 times 4 2000 so let's have it uh, 14000 for the transportation how about lodging and accommodation so perhaps you if you want to stay in the hotel where i stayed i, I inquired uh on their on the staff and i think there's like 10000 per day so if you're going to stay there for like uh, 3 days or, or so so sabihin natin 30000 for the Accommodation, medyo may kamahalan. And drinks and food, so let's say 1,000 per person per day for, let's say, for three days. So let's 
computed it already, it's about 12,000. Entertainment, relaxation, sabi natin wala muna. Kasi may kasama mga bata, you cannot just go in, you know. Uh, activities, water sports, perhaps you're going to do island hopping for the, the, the more, uh, the, the less pala, the less people, the more expensive. So 800 per person, so for island hopping. And let's say some paddle, um, magpapaddle kayo. Okay? And other activities. So other activities. So let's just put it uh, 4,000 for the sports water activities. And other expenses, so let's say bibili ka ng souvenir. So let's just cap it to 4,000. So for this trip, medyo may kamahala. No? 62,000 for the family of four person uh, tax. Okay? Now let's consider tipid. Paano natin pamumo magiging mas mura to? Okay, let me... Okay. So sa transpo, I think you have to book as early as you can. Wala tayong magagawa dyan eh. So, ganun talaga eh. So, sabi natin pareho. Hindi natin mapapa... Mahal talaga ang transportation. If you're going to consider traveling by boat, uh, I, will, I, will, I wouldn't I would recommend it kasi it's time-consuming and it's uh, tiring. You know, nakakapagod. Nakakapagod yung biyahe. And lodging and accommodation, now there are uh, uh, rent, like you're going to rent a house. I've, I've no, uh, uh, three years ago, uh, I met my friends there and they actually rented a house, like their second floor. And, yeah, so first and second floor, so medyo malaki, no? So they're only paying for 4,000 for actually, I think there are like five to six of them for three days. So, kumbaga 12,000 lang. Uh, okay, but it's actually good for five to six persons. So kayo, kanyari, apat lang. Much, much more space for you guys. Uh, food and drinks, let's say, let's just keep, match kunyari, magluluto kayo doon. Kasi pwede magluto doon. So let's say you're going to do some groceries, 1,500 per day. So let's times three. So let's just like 4,500. Let's just put it uh, 5,000 for the for the whole family already. Entertainment, wala tayo niyan. Activities, water, sports. Now in this case, instead of booking a, an island hopping for for 10 persons, perhaps what you can consider is yung, yung boat for 25 person, and that's only 550. So 550 lang yun. So 550 times 4, that's 2,200. Okay? So, and then if you plan to do pa, paddle and other, so let's cap it to 2,500. So medyo adjusted na to. 2,500. Other expenses, siguro... Souvenirs, yeah, so let's say 1,500, pero actually may mga murang souvenirs doon, you know, some small bottles, island, uh, Boracay Island, but let's just, let's just assign 1,000. So see, uh, 35,500 for the whole family as compared to this uh, more expensive, so it, it's up to you. So merong adjustment in in, in whatever you, you pr ano yung preference ng, ng family. Okay, pero may budget, mga budget, ano, pwedeng makatipid. Okay, so I think that's all for, for this vlog. Uh, thank you for watching, if you've watched my previous vlog, vlog. So I hope you've learned something today from this uh, uh, vlog of financial aspect of the, the travels in Boracay. So see you soon. Okay, bye-bye. Tschüss.